Cyber Time Lords. I don't know what accent this is, but it's gonna go for about one more second. Okay, I'm back. Hey guys! So, that was interesting, wasn't it? Um, yeah. It's 2013! I'm excited, are you excited? To be honest, I thought we were just gonna skip to 2014, because like, you know when you're on, you're on like lifts, it goes level 11, level 12, level 14, because 13's an unlucky number? Why are we celebrating 2013? If we just skip to 2014, then I finish school, and everyone can party! Hey! Is that not how it works? Oh. Um, I may look slightly blue, but that's because it's an overcast day and it is still 30 degrees. Which is... Yeah, figure that out in Fahrenheit for yourselves. <laughs> How was your New Year's Eve? I spent my New Year's Eve with like family and friends and all that jazz because they're awesome! And yeah! I hope the New Year's been good for you guys so far because it's been pretty awesome for me. I mean like, looking at my calendar over here and there's literally nothing, 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 nothing. Friend's birthday. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Uh, by the way, where all the nothings are, it's me on YouTube, Tumblr, interwebs in general, playing Sims 3, because I am in love with Sims 3, and I'm a little bit devastated because Sims Ambitions, which is my new expansion pack, which is so totally awesome, um, on my laptop isn't working, so I cry silent. Well, they're not very silent, they're quite audible, I'm pretty sure um, everyone in England could hear me by now, but um, every time I start playing, it just doesn't work and then I open the laptop and it, I, I just put the CD in, I click on my game, I try to move where I want to and it freezes and I get the blue screen of death. It's just, it's an emotional time for me guys. I'm sorry, just need a second. Um, another thing which I've been doing a lot these holidays so far is reading because school starts on February 1st and I still haven't read all the books I need to read. I am a well, I'm that much, that much, through um, 1984, which is pretty good, and I accidentally wrote a story exactly like this for my major work without reading this book. Oops. <laughs> but it's okay, because it's an awesome story, and I do really like George Orwell. I really liked Animal Farm. Like, this, the progression of the story was good. It was a small, it was only ten chapters, which I really loved, and it was good progression of the story, and it was quite interesting. The writing style though, oh, it's like when I was reading Jane Eyre, it's just very descriptive. I don't really care for descriptive, I want, I want action, which is why I still read kids books like Tomorrow When the War Began, which is by the way one of my favourite books ever, it's a series, and you need to all read them, I'm only on the fourth book, but there's like four more, and then there's the Ellie, Ellie Chronicles, which I will get to eventually, and I've been reading this for like two years, because school is difficult and I don't like to read often because interwebs is better. Anyway, there we go. That's a good book. That's not the first one. The first one's up there, but I'm not going to go grab it, because you can Google it. You're on the internet already, please. Another thing I've been really enjoying these holidays is scented candles, even though it's boiling. All I, it's so good. All I have to do to light it is just stick it outside for two seconds, come back in, and it's like burning, like flat fireballs. It smells so good. This one is a soy candle. It's Japanese honeysuckle from Planet Yum. I don't know where you can get these, but they are amazing. It smells so good. I got it on the top of a national park in the middle of nowhere. It took us three hours to get there, and the ro roads are like this the entire way. There's a mountain up this side, and there's just cliffs, and there are one-way roads, and there are cars coming both ways, and I'm just there bracing my myself like this, going, Dad, you better drive well. And he's just there with one hand, casually. Woo! Did you see that? We just went around the corner. Oh, I'm just going to turn the car back now. I'm like, Dad, two hands on the wheel. That was a fun trip. Um, I'll try and insert some photos here, and if there are no photos, you know why. Um, bad editing. Yeah. Um, I also got to feed some llamas. Oh, no, sorry, not llamas, alpacas. They're like llamas, but cooler. Um, and they were so soft. And then to get them to come over to you, you had to be like, come on! And you had to like yell it, because they were like in this massive paddock, and we... We went through three bags of feed because you just get there and you'd be like, okay, you can eat it. Oh, 
god, there goes my hand. No, that's my hand. Stop eating my hand. And then you just have to go grab another handful of the feed. And we just ended up going through three bags of like feed, which is like this big. And they had little babies as well. And it was the cutest thing ever. I also fed some birds, which is pretty awesome as well. And I really, really like those birds because some of them are evil. Like the big ones, I was like, I want all the little ones. They're so cute. No, the little ones are evil. They had blood on their beaks because they'd been fighting. So I was there. I had this massive plate because like when you hold it, Insert a picture now. Okay, maybe not. Um, I had this massive plate of food, and the birds would come and like lean on me, and I had them flying onto my head and onto my shoulders and every possible body part you can imagine. I had one on my foot for one moment, then I realized, hey, food's up here, so it flew up. I was swooped a couple of times. It was pretty darn good. Anyway, I had the food in my hand, and I had all these birds around on the plate. And I had, there were the big birds, and it was such a pretty photo, and then this little, tiny little thing, but this big, flies on, and just goes, ah! and just, they all fly away, and I was just, and I was like, you're the bully of this little bird group here, and I do not like you, but you have blood all over you, so I'm just gonna, just gonna go like that, yeah, eat as much as you want, just, just you wanna go, just, just leave now, please leave, and then try to eat me like a lump alpacas oh god sorry the llamas is just the in there because it's alpacas cast alpacas yeah the alpacas that's it alpaca i've babbled on for enough please don't forget to rate comment subscribe all that jazz you know the drill um yeah I love you guys loud. Bye. I'm going to do that with glitter one day. But I can't have glitter because I'm in a bedroom. Yeah. Frustrations of a YouTuber.